You got another? Uh, just a little bit of pee left in you? No. Oh, when I leave here, I'm gonna get spooked. But I'm gonna be spooked by a cat. Guaranteed. Okay, that was a man's legs. How fast is he? <laughs> Somebody's been eating my hamburgers. You better not have used one of my three bottles of artisan ketchup. There's two hamburgers on the table. Still can't go to sleep. Haven't haven't triggered sleep yet. The fridge door. I'm sure I closed it. Oh, come on, it, it couldn't have just opened on its own. the weirdest apartment. It's like such a good apartment decorated so poorly. Nobody can hide from you in this apartment. It's so open. There's someone here. There's someone in the apartment. The phone on the desk. I could call for help. The front door. It's the only way out. If I can reach it, I still have a chance. Which one is the front door? <gasps> I always forget it's a pull. <gasps> Yo, it's actually mute. Thank you for your sacrifice. Um, he's behind her now, or there's multiple people hiding in our 800 square foot apartment. Thought he was just gonna toss her straight out of the window. London. I still... Oh, there are two. Okay. How did two people hide from her in this apartment with no walls? Bite his ear through the balaclava? That was a complete mind flood. Yes! Oh, I should have gone for the 32 inch. Oh. Actual assassin. all a dream <laughs> she wakes up like 18 dudes pop up from under the couch dun 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 couple dudes pop down from the ceiling Two jump in through the window. One comes out of the TV screen like the evil girl from the ring.
I love that the inches goes to the thousandth of an inch. <laughs> 1.713 inches of rain today. When the parents came home from church, all their children were gone. They searched and called for them, they cried and begged, but it was all to no avail. The children have never been seen again. Jeez, thanks a lot, Comcast. Maybe the killer left his return address on the... I have to get out of here and find out what this ticket is about. Find out what this ticket is about. Mr. Mars! Mr. Mars! A few Mars. words! Mr. Mars! Goddamn reporters. They've been camped outside my house all day. Mr. Mars, how many sons do you plan to lose this year? Mr. Mars, I mean, come on, it's kind of ridiculous, right? Mr. Mars! Mr. Mars. Mr. Mars. A few Mars. words! Mr. Mars! Mr. Mars, can you confirm that your son has disappeared? Do you think the origami killer Mr. Mars, kidnapped him? Get another car. Mr. Mars, did your son I'm disappear? I'm going to walk Mars, straight please, to that car without Mr. stopping Mars, on the way. Are you worried your son might Mr. be dead? Mr. Mars, do you suspect anyone, Mr. Mars? Do you know if the investigators have any leads? You lost your son in the park. How do you feel about that? Wait. Mr. Mars, can you confirm that your son do has you think disappeared? Your son is still alive. Uh, hello, Mr. Mars. You've been nominated for World's Worst Father. <laughs> I like that. Mr. Mars, I just wanted to say it. Everybody's saying it this day and age. Mr. Mars! Don't even check Twitter, Mr. Mars. Low blood sugar. Gonna, gonna have to make it through the crowd. I can't, can't take crowds. Just can't handle it. I'm just not gonna make it. I'm tightening up. I can't go on. No time to waste. I need to find out what's in that locker. I, I can't make it. Too many people. Too many people. <sighs> This is Comic Con. <laughs> You've got to make it to the Inhumans panel. Excuse me, sir. Excuse me, if you pardon me. If you don't mind, if you'll just excuse me. Sorry about that. Get out of the way. Pardon me. Jason! 
Oh, I think he might be around here. This is my mistake. I think. Oh, hello, Jason. Oh, no. Jason! Get back here, young man. have to excuse me here. Pardon me, I need to get to my son, Jason. Oh, so you're just like, good. Dad. Only in New York. Hey, it's the Jason guy again. Line 18, box number three. Line 18, box number 3. Line 18, box number 3. Line 18. Box number 3. He's done it. I hope it's the other Ultra Boost V2 I requested from Santa Claus. I'm gonna do something this traumatic. I'm gonna need one beer, some liquid courage. Hey, unboxing. Get ready. Spring collection. I love when it shakes when it's like emotional. Yeah, it's not like there's a gun in there. Just turn it over on the desk. Are you prepared to show courage to save your son? Joe's Garage and Parking Lot, 4988 Roosevelt Avenue, Lexington. Yeah, everyone's like, oh, there's a metal detector. How did he get the gun in there? Uh, the gun was in a cardboard box. It shielded it from the electromagnetic waves of the X-ray machine. Best not to ask questions about the dimensions of that, I think. Help! Dad! Sean! Where are you? I'm so cold! Dad! Dad! 
Oh, so he's got like after effects or something. It's got electrical inveterates. Five origami figures. Each figure is a trial. Each trial provides letters. The letters reveal an address. Oh. No, take the box, you madman! Take the box, you fool! Wow, they're really making sure I cannot go back and grab the origami. <laughs> hey, you know their new bonus. Killer is white, aged between 30 and 45. He we know you don't have to keep post, going on about it. Crimes in a very meticulous fashion. He doesn't have anything personal against the victims. That's why he covers their faces with mud to make them anonymous. Why does he kill them if he doesn't have anything against them? For him, they're more of an image, a symbol. That's probably why he gives them an origami figure and an orchid as gifts to apologize for what he's done to them. Very interesting. And where does all that get us? The best way of tracking a predator is to be familiar with his behavior. That may be true in novels, but there's a child's life at stake here. Continue, Jaden. Who the heck is Jaden? Then I studied the geographical distribution of the murders. Generally, a killer commits his first murder near to where he lives, so he has a safe place to flee to if any complications arise. Killer the more victims. Confident he becomes it's like a bad Netflix show. Face. By analyzing the locations where the victims disappeared, I was able to isolate a zone where the killer might live. And, and what size is this uh, zone? For the moment, about 10 square miles. Oh, great. There must be 10,000 people live in that sort of area. You gonna question them one by one? The more clues we get, the more we can reduce the zone. We can then cross-check it with our list of suspects and identify the killer. Don't forget about one that heavy rainfall. One detail attracted my attention. The interval between the time when a victim disappears and the time when the body is found ranges from three to five days. But the rainfall is always at six inches, give or take 10%. What on earth does that mean? All the victims were drowned in rainwater. The killer kills only in the fall when there is plenty of rain. It could be that he puts them in some sort of well or tank that is open to the skies and that fills up with rainwater. The more it rains, the less time the victim has to live. So what? You gave her like kidnapped a kid, and then the there are two meteorologist was just wrong. Might fit and he ends up having this kid hanging zone. out for like two I'd weeks. I'd like to question them. Ah, damn it! We're wasting our time with this bullshit. The killer's out there somewhere. We got to get off our asses and find him. Go for him. Blake, I've had just about enough of your shit. You've been chasing this guy for what? Two years? And what are you caught, huh? Nothing. Absolutely nothing! What, well, you think you can do a better fucking job than me with your psychology degree and your great glasses? <laughs> well, let me tell you something, pal. That don't mean zip when it comes to getting out there. You're just a fucking bureaucrat. And your great, your delightful glasses. Your fucking sweet ass, technologically marvelous glasses. From being murdered. Fucking asshole! That's enough. All right, all right, believe the glass is out of it. You said it took six inches of rainfall before the victim died. How much time do we have left? If the weather forecasts are right, less than 72 hours. Jesus fucking Christ. Watch out, he might stab you in the back for the Ray-Bans. No, for the last time, you can't put them on. They're locked to my genetic code. Aries right, so gotta trust you. Time coming here. 
Maybe we should have a little look inside anyway. There's nobody home. There is now. Yeah, you fancy glasses ever kicked sure down a door without having due process? 